I'm Madison Carter here at 7 Eyewitness News. We're going to take you through the 716 in just two minutes. There's a new law in the books today aimed at protecting drivers from being taken advantage of when you park in the city of Buffalo. The law focuses on companies that put boots on your car and charge high fees to get them removed. This happens in lots where there are no attendants. The hope is that the new rule will make people feel more comfortable with parking downtown while also not allowing parking companies to take advantage of people by using their cars as leverage. At the end of the day, when people complained, we listened and we made an adjustment. Um, if a person feels they'll never come to downtown Buffalo because they had an experience with one situation, that's unfortunate. It's not something that I can change. What I can change is the law. Under the new rules, the charge for booting a vehicle in a private lot that is not a pay for parking lot can't exceed $75. Boots must be removed within one hour after the request for removal has been made. There also will need to be proper signage warning of booting in the lots. Those new rules will be voted on later today, but they are expected to pass. And this week, the state is beefing up its laws to protect your kids when they're out driving. Starting Friday, all your children under the age of two must be in a rear facing car seat anytime they're riding in a car. If your child gets too big for the infant car seat before their second birthday, you can put them in either a convertible or an all in one seat. All right, let's check in with meteorologist Autumn Lewandowski for a look at your forecast. It's a warm afternoon, 15 degrees above average in the 60s and we'll be dropping into the 50s and even up in 40 upper 40s as we head into our night. Our winds will also be calming down as well. Taking a look at where we are dealing with any more cloud cover or rain, not across the Great Lakes just yet, but as it comes in, we are going to deal with high winds as well. A high wind watch posted for our Halloween evening through 8 p.m. on Friday. Wind gusts near 50 and even 60 miles an hour. There will also be a lakeshore flood watch posted for that same time frame along the lakeshore between Erie County and Chautauqua.